Well, Governor Susana Martinez says there will eventually be about 150 National Guardsmen helping out Border Patrol agents. But she says those National Guardsmen who are also police officers will not be deployed. Governor Martinez checking in with U.S. Customs and Border Patrol and the National Guard near the Santa Teresa Port of Entry. We're, we're in a crisis on the Mexican border of people coming across with drug trafficking, with um, sex trafficking. The governor deployed National Guardsmen to the border earlier this month, following President Trump's order of National Guardsmen to the U.S.-Mexico border. They're there to help Border Patrol agents concentrate on border security. The Guardsmen will do jobs like work on cars, ATVs, and even take care of horses used for mounted patrols. In maintenance of any kind of vehicle maintenance, if we have a Border Patrol agent doing actually the vehicle maintenance, that Border Patrol agent cannot be boots on the ground on the border. Governor Martina says her office will be in touch with the White House to see how long the National Guardsmen need to be down here. But in the meantime, she says there's just no telling how long that will actually be. Reporting in Donia Ana County, Justin Matthews, KOAT Action 7 News.